Anti-Pakistan protests are taking place in Jammu following the attack on two army vehicles, uh, which of course martyred five Jawans and injured three. Of course, you use those visuals on your screen showcasing this anti-Pakistan protest that has now taken place in Jammu. My colleague Ajay Jandial still with us on the broadcast. Ajay, over to you. Yes, you know, there is anger among the civilians over here in Jammu and Kashmir and not only in Jammu and Kashmir, all over the country, uh, the civilians and uh, people, those who live in the country, those who know the value of the forces, they are condemning this attack and protesting against Pakistan and demanding that there is a need of action against Pakistan, whatever, uh, uh, you know, what uh, forces have done in the past also, like in, uh, in uh, Balakot, like uh, they have done in there uh, uh, after the Uri incident uh, took place. So that's why they are saying that there is a need of action against Pakistan and terror ke launch pad camps has to be targeted by the forces that is what the solution could be because we know how uh, forces they are uh, you know making sure that civilians of this country they can uh, live peacefully but Pakistan is continuously sending the terrorists from across they are their army personnel they are they have been uh, you know used as a terrorist here in the Jammu and Kashmir so that's why it is not only uh, you know uh, uh, forces versus uh, terrorists but it should be uh, forces versus forces and that's why Pakistan uh, should be, uh, you know, uh, kept accountable for this and pa there, there is a need that action should be taken against Pakistan and terrorists, those who are sitting across in the Pakistan territory and Pakistan occupied Kashmir. For more such videos, subscribe to the NewsX YouTube channel, hit the bell icon.